Well, hello and good morning everyone. So um, today I'm down in Cutting, Portland in England. It is very, very cold. It's January, but the sun is out a little bit and the um, condition is actually really good. The friction is good. And uh, I just went up, warm up on this 6B. It's a really good route. And um, now I'm going to try this AA cool underdress. So um, I need to head over there and get the quick draws in and try to work out some of the moves. Let's go. I'm going to put a next quick draw in first then and then I'm going to slap. So um, this is basically the first hard move, first of the crux move on this AA. You um, do quite a big throw to this maybe quarter of a pad, grab this crimp it and you come up to this relatively good side pull. And after you see your feet out and you come into an like intermediate undercut down here, somewhere here, and you do a big throw to this another small quarter pad crimp sort of thing. After you take this tiny, tiny undercling way above your head, then get your left foot up more or less on your shoulder sort of thing, just down here, and you sit on it. Online, does it? And you go up to that side port, oh, I don't know, probably 8mm or something. Grab that. I'm not sure if I use this thumb, but I must have done because there's some chalk on here. And you do a huge span to this really good flake. Yeah, this is really good. Really good flake. And you got a few more hard moves. When you get to that, that hole there, then there's then you're pretty much pretty much in a bag. So yeah, I'm going to uh, go up, put a quick draws in the rest of the routes, and then refine the sequence and give you a go. Very cool, very cool moves. Oh no, wrong. I need to get my foot up first. I fuck up that foot. Should have got a foot up first. There? Yeah. No. Nope. Can't see that foot. Don't be good for here. Oh, that felt hard. Felt really hard actually. Maybe I'm getting towards that end of the day and starting to get really tired. I didn't do anything wrong that time, but when I'm on that side pull and that right hand crimp, the hole is so blind for the foot. 
to run around just hanging there and you we, we can't see really if you're allowed to come out a little bit which i can't then you would be able to see that right foothole i found another way that kind of really didn't think about it before so I bump the left hand into the previous right hand crimp and that allowed me to come out of the wall and get the foot up but that's meant the next couple of moves is a lot harder to get the um, left foot up to that really really high and then to pull in on the left hand undercling so <laughs> not sure not sure because one way is more efficient on the energy but you can't see your foot <laughs> the other way you can see your foot but it's a lot more powerful and I'm getting really tired not very exciting here at the minute basically I'm getting ready to go clean the route I've just been sitting resting I usually time my rest it depends on the route, sometimes 20 minutes and sometimes an hour. Depends how long the route and how tired I feel. But even now after like 30 minute rest, I'm still feeling like pretty tired. I think I must have really used that left arm on the first time I went out when I screw up my foot. And uh, now the sun's get real low and it's getting really cold. So I'm gonna go up, clean the route and um, come back another day I think. That'll be the smart plan. So, see you in a couple of weeks. Well, hello and good morning, everyone. I am back in the cuttings again. I was here last weekend trying um, this route called Underdress and uh, yeah didn't get it last week so I'm gonna go up and put these quick jaws in and yeah see what happened There, my fingers cold. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Yeah, I thought I was gonna go for it, but then my finger got cold when I got there. I feel really sharp today. Maybe because I don't have much skin. <laughs> I usually put the quick jaws in on the next one, but whenever I'm red pointing the roots, I I don't clip it, so today I'm not going to put it in at all. It's only getting in the way. So that way it's better. I don't have any hesitation whether to clip or not clip. If it's not there, then I can't clip. So that's what we're going to do. Cool. All right, let's give these dog shit hole a brush. Not quite sure what happened that time. I'm usually quite good at, you know, knowing what went wrong. Um, I got to that right hand crimp, I thought I was quite solid on it, but then pff, I just fell off. Yeah, it's tricky, it's tricky.
No. Okay. No, I've got it wrong. I know now what I did wrong. Okay. Yeah. yeah. I know exactly what I did wrong. Okay. That was the same as last time. The last two attempts I've been going to like this. And as you can see here, this little notch is getting in the way, so I can't really crimp and bone down on it. So that's why I fell off the last two attempts. So on the right hand crimp, uh -huh. there's a good bit, which is a little bit further right, where I can really get the thumb over. But that time I went, I realized like, why can't I pull on this? Because the my hand was ever so slightly, maybe like, half of a centimetre or something, too far left. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> to carry on <laughs> holding on that whole day and shaking it. Well, I'm going to stop copying your roots first. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Here you go. No scent today, but oh boy, I couldn't be more happier. Sometimes things just doesn't go your way, you know, you don't warm up or your fingers cold. In this case, fingers got cold, but I was staying on that dog shit undercut and enough time for me to go and choke my hand, try to warm it up. But I don't know what I was thinking to be honest because it's like my fingers cold what do I do I put in my chalk <laughs> maybe it'll, you know warm up a little bit but it wasn't enough but that's not the point the point is that I was up there fighting climbing really well <sighs> super happy Yay, super buddy. happy nice so I'll probably see you in the next couple of weeks or maybe next week but the journey will continue I can't believe how much you're going to be saying this. It might even be too hot today. So good morning everyone. I'm back here in the cutting. Again, feel like I live here now. Still trying this under duress. Today might be the day because I'm actually not cold and I'm not wearing a down jacket. Hopefully it's not going to be too warm. It shouldn't be. I mean, it's February in England, so it's probably like 10 degree or something. But because of the sun's out, it's still really warm. And um, I think I might just go straight on it. Do a little bit of fingerboarding on the ground to get my finger warm, ready for those dog shit crimp. The less attempt I have, the better, because each time I go on the route, it takes a lot of skin out. And I don't have a lot of skin <laughs> today. Cool. Let's get warm up. I can't believe this. I was worried it was going to be so cold again today, so I packed like one jacket, a hat, and my big jacket. And now I'm stripping down to a t shirt. Might have to take it off later. It is warm in February.
slippery. First red point of the day went a lot better than I expected. But when I got to the um, good flake and um, tried to clip, I think I'm spending too much time putting the jaws in and pulling the ropes out and um, the hand just turned really slippery. And then when I fell off, look at my hand, just look like pace. So it's definitely a little bit too much on the warm side today, but compared to last week, I think condition today is better because I'm not, I'm not feeling cold um, and my finger's not numb. <laughs> Game's on. Such a cool route still. Very cool moves. Like, bah, 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 uh, uh, uh. The sun has finally gone in. Started to feel quite cold. Not cold, but nice. Sorry, just watching Faye climbing. So yeah, I had, um, had some water, had some coffee. Dino will bring coffee. So Dino, you can definitely come climbing again with me. Um, yeah, because you bring a very nice coffee. I'm gonna walk over and give it another go, I think, while it's still nice and cool. Oh man, I have to try really hard that time. Oh yes, 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 
Yes, yes, yes. I'm very happy. So happy with that. Just as I was saying earlier when I was up there. I think the battery ran out. I have to fight time. so hard. Every hand was every move was difficult because I didn't quite get it right. When I get to the um the left hand flake and then I got this, you know, it's okay, but the foot is like terrible. So I have to do this big move to that thing. Usually I can do that like every time, but when I got that right hand, I was ready to give in. But then I thought, no, fuck this shit. I'm gonna get my heel in. I'm gonna scream my way out of it. Oh, so happy. It's been a long, long four weekends, um, but you know. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you again soon.